Today's Gospel, Sunday, November 29, is taken from St. Mark, chapter 13, verses 33 to 37. Jesus said to his disciples, Be watchful, be alert. You do not know when the time will come. It is like a man traveling abroad. He leaves home and places his servants in charge, each with his work, and orders the gatekeeper to be on the watch. Watch, therefore, you do not know when the Lord of the house is coming, whether in the evening, or at midnight, or at cockcrow, or in the morning. May he not come suddenly and find you sleeping. What I say to you, I say to all, watch. The Gospel of the Lord Today's faith food reflection is by Father Ray Hella of the Orders of the Servants of Mary. On this first Sunday of Advent, the liturgy asks us to be watchful, that is to say, be observant, alert, and conscious of what is going around. It pertains to everything that happens and might be happening around us, including the signs of the times that might be pointing to a very important event of a man's life, the coming of the Lord. After all, Advent means coming. We should live a life of preparation every day by doing the task for which we are charged. We are in charge of our life in this world and should not put blame on others when we fail. The Lord's admonition is so forceful that He puts the emphasis, therefore, to issue a stern warning. The Lord is sure to come, or better, we are sure to come to the Lord in death. Call it morbid, but we have the saying, Life is short and death is certain. Kaya nga lagi tayo dapat magdasal dahil hindi natin alam kailan ang buhay, kailan ang wakas. Maaaring kunin ka ni Lord sa araw, sa gabi, o kaya sa madaling araw. Marami sa atin hindi na nagigising. Kaya bago matulog, mas mainam na magdasal at humingi ng patawad sa Panginoon. Higit sa lahat, pag natulog, umiti ka naman para pag namatay, hindi ka nakasimangot. Sana lang huwag bigla ang dating ni Lord. That is why the Lord asks us also to pray that He may not come suddenly and find you sleeping. St. Paul also admonished us to possess spiritual gifts as we wait the revelation of our Lord Jesus Christ. But we wait for the coming of the Lord in joyful hope, not in hysterical expectation. Enjoy lang tayo sa buhay habang naghihintay kay Lord. Sa mga kabataan, lagi kong sinasabi, Enjoy life. Try everything but vice and sin. Explore life. But do not forget that there is God. Be responsible in all your activities. Involve God always. Let us pray. Lord, I want to live my life with you always by my side. Guide me in everything that I think, say, and do. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.